Hello everyone, Lane here, and I'm going to be doing a get ready with me because I'm going to be taking some headshots to hopefully uh, send to some modeling companies. So we're going to do my makeup, we're going to get into clothes, my hair is pretty much all ready done. Got some incense burning, very lovely, trying to get the atmosphere right. So first things first, I'm going to try to get my contacts in. This does not go well, but we're going to try because I want to put some makeup on. So we'll see how that goes. And that is right that's swollen actually. Look pretty good. I'm just gonna go for a simple look today. I'm not gonna put on any of that white foundation or anything. I like to start with my eyes first because I've got a very dramatic look with the black eyeshadow. It kind of falls out a little bit. So by doing it first, I can go ahead and uh, clean it up if I have to before I put on my foundation. First, we're gonna do under our eyes. And then for a little bit, I did like um, take an eyeliner and do kind of like a base coat with it, but I have figured out how do I apply my uh, eyeshadow better. So we're gonna be doing that instead. Just mixed in the primer with my eyeshadow, so should be pretty good. It doesn't look too bad. Now we're gonna do under the eye. see some bits I need to clean up. That's okay. I'm gonna do the same with the other side. Primer. Use the brush to mix that in. do underneath. Just like that. And then I'm going to take this brush right here. I'm going to spray it with some setting powder. So it's a little wet and then I'm going to get this shimmer right here and just place it right in the corner of my eye. Mascara. 
And then I'm going to go ahead and clean up the sides. Just like that. I'm going to cover my face in this anti-red moisturizer, like this anti, I guess rosacea, whatever you want to call it, it moisturizer. It's from MAC. Uh, Complete Comfort Cream. I'm just going to put this all over my face as preparation, as like a kind of primer for my powder foundation. Whenever I wear white, I use liquid, but whenever I just use my regular skin tone, I use a powder because I don't know, I like the look of it better. Again, I'm using a MAC foundation. I think this is like light plus. <laughs> I am incredibly white. German. So that's fun, I guess. I don't like to go too heavy with the natural foundation. If I'm doing a dramatic look with the white, then like I'll go for it. But like with this kind of simplistic look with the regular foundation, uh, I just, I don't lay anything on too heavy. Lastly, I'll put on some lipstick. So I go in with a black liquid liner and pretty much cover the entire lips while exaggerating my cupid's bow because that's a very goth thing to do. It's very trad goth, which I love. It's one of my favorite. Trad and romantic are my favorite types of goth. I do love corporate goth though. I'm not gonna put on any contour or blush or highlight or anything like that because I don't really like that stuff. I like to look more dead, I suppose. But um, we're gonna go change into, oh, dark. We're gonna go change into some goth clothes. Okay, so for a modeling role, you're gonna wear, you're gonna wanna wear something tight. Um, I'm just gonna be doing basic headshots today. You know, nothing, anything crazy, but I've got this kind of like tight, like, here, let me see if I could. I've got this tight kind of, not brassiere, but like, you know, shirt, just like cute. Um, I don't have any tight pants, but it'll be fine. Uh, I've got the basics down, so uh, these are just stuff for me to send in to people. I will get professional headshots later on, but um yeah, I basically just gotta wear something tight and I've got something tight. So we're gonna take some photos and I will get back to you guys. Okay, so I've just got the basics, like, you know, facing forward, facing to the side, um, waist up and then full body. It doesn't show too well on this program I'm using to edit, but uh, I feel like I got the photos good enough. I don't like how red my face is. I don't like that there's hair where there shouldn't be. My skin isn't as clear as could be, but I think people pick me. Here I am after my photo shoot. I've taken up my makeup and showering. Um, I'm a beginner model. I haven't even had a gig yet. I am going to get some professional headshots soon. Hopefully get some jobs booked soon. But if you're interested in following along with my model journey, I'm just now getting into the plus size goth kind of community. So follow along if you're interested. Um, I don't know how often I'm going to be doing these videos, but 
uh, I'm really excited. So thank you guys for watching. Bye.